why don't we kick off with a little something to tickle your funny bone? So here goes. Why don't scientists trust atoms because they make up everything? Quite a punch from the world of quantum physics, eh? Now, speaking of trust, let's delve into the fascinating world of misplaced trust. You know, the kind of trust that makes you think your pet goldfish is secretly a mastermind plotting world domination. Or that your houseplant is an undercover agent for the CIA, alright? Alright, maybe I'm exaggerating a tad, but hey, the world is full of misplaced trust. And it's not just limited to our little fishy friends or verdant companions. Take the case of the posh gentleman who bought an invisible art piece for a whopping $50,000. The artwork, mind you, was literally nothing. Zilch. Nada. The artist just sold him an idea, a concept. And the gentleman, bless his heart, bought it. Talk about seeing the Emperor's new clothes. Then there's the tale of the lady who bought a plot on the moon. Yes, the moon. The big white thing in the sky at night. She got a deed and everything. Now she's waiting for Elon Musk to give her a lift to her lunar real estate. Maybe she'll start a cheese farm. Who knows? And who could forget the guy who bought the Eiffel Tower? Twice. A con man convinced him that the iconic landmark was for sale. Not once, but twice. It's like buying the same non-existent bridge over and over again. It's a landmark case of fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, I'm probably rich enough to not care. But the crown jewel of misplaced trust has to be the man who bought a magic lamp for $200,000. The lamp was supposed to have a genie inside. I mean, who wouldn't want their own personal genie? But alas, the only thing that came out of the lamp was a whole lot of disappointment and probably a puff of really expensive dust. You see, trusting atoms may be risky, but at least they're consistent. They make up everything, all the time. Unlike that invisible art piece, the plot on the moon, the Eiffel Tower or the magic lamp, Atoms don't play hide-and-seek with reality. They're always there, making up everything from the air we breathe to the stars in the sky. So to wrap things up, remember, it's okay to trust atoms. They're the building blocks of the universe, after all. But when it comes to invisible art, lunar real estate, iconic landmarks or magic lamps, perhaps it's best to keep your dollars in your wallet and your trust in your pocket. And if you ever find yourself doubting this advice, just remember the guy who bought the Eiffel Tower twice. Because, let's be honest, that's a mistake worth repeating dot 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 in a joke.